Good morning, Irvine. It is Saturday, January 23rd, and I am here uh, in Irvine, California, so, uh, Southern California, Orange County, and you might notice this is a kind of a empty store situation that we got going on here. Let me make sure my mic is in the right place. Uh, look over here. A lot of empty shelves. Uh, the frozen section is still relatively... Um, yeah, you see right here. Uh, this Albertson store uh, we are currently in. I'll walk down the frozen aisle so you can see. Uh, we are on Culver and Irvine, Maine, I believe. This is the second closest Albertsons from my house. Pizza still all here. Uh, this Albertsons has been confirmed to be ending their lease agreement. Uh, apparently, from what I read online, um, this location has uh, management, corporate, has made the decision that the rent is too damn high, right? We all remember that. Um, no, but seriously, the, 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 they've made the decision that the rent is uh, too expensive and they are no longer uh, profitable. So they have made the decision to terminate their lease agreement and they re will be vacating the store. So word on the street is there will be a popular, well-known, um, Asian-focused, uh, Korean food-focused uh, grocery chain that would be coming in here. Um, again, word on the street is uh, it will be H Mart that will be taking over this Alperson's location. And again, word on the street is if I have time to drive over there, uh, and you might notice it is got a little bit of drizzle today. <sighs> kind of symbolic of this Albertson's current situation. But uh, yeah, I just came to update my community, update everyone in, the, in, in my neighborhood, because this is, like I said, this is probably, I think, 2.8 miles from my house. So not even 10 minutes from my house, uh, this, Alber this Albertson's, um, just so you kind of have an idea of the square here. There's a Subway's over there, there's a donut over there, there's a Jack in the Box, which I might have to frequent right now because it is extremely cold for a 58 degrees wet morning. There is a Happy Nail Salon, Green Commuter Car, uh, Bank, Chipotle, Tang and Tang. Uh, I'll, I'll be honest, I am not a frequent uh, patron here. I don't come to this particular square. Uh, I usually go to the, uh, you know, the Ralphs over by the freeway, uh, Heritage, the 99 ranches, um, you know, and then, and then maybe a little bit to Scion Market, maybe a little bit to Trader Joe's or, you know, the marketplace to pick up my favorite coffee at Black Coffee. Um, yeah, this is a this is a relatively small, quiet neighborhood square. Um, you know, uh, Irvine Master Plan from the '70s or '80s uh, is designed so that it is still very walkable. Um, but 
this is you know this is all Irvine company so they have uh, you know as a as a free market enterprise they have uh, you know every every right in their in their disposal to uh, set prices for their tenants and you know in this particular case the tenants have free uh, free market um, to decide to renew their lease or to vacate the premises and for a new tenant to take over so uh, this particular Albertsons has made the decision and I'm gonna probably go check out the second Albertsons and I'll be back Of course, I have to do all this filming during the first of the year of this beautiful rain. How you doing? This is fine. This is not too bad. Watch the traffic. Check my face covering. And I am here. We are at the West Park uh, location, again, off of Clover. Yep. A lot of empty shelf ends, I think is what they like to call it. So let's find a empty aisle. Pet food? Yes, no one's checking out pet food, but pet food is still relatively stocked. We are in aisle 10. Yep, you can see the condition of things. I don't know what the... I don't know what the situation is. A lot of charger gears. Wow, look at that. <laughs> A whole bunch of fidget spinners. Unite, BDN, LA Rams. Oh, that's cute. Look at that. Little freaking ruins. Hey, decent price too. Any SC fans? Charger fans? Young, young Charger fans, the tiny ones. All right, do a little coast clear. So, you see, there's no one within sight of me. So I'm just gonna cruise on by. Hey, apple pie, okay. Um, let's put this back on. Now I know there's a, I know there's a Starbucks in here, so I'm gonna look for a Starbucks because I could really use a warm drink, and I'm curious if uh, if there will be more, <coughs> if there will be more later. Yeah, look at those. So this store is, you can tell, they're uh, they're clearing their inventory. They're not they're not bringing in more inventory. Uh, for obvious reasons so once once these are off the shelves they start moving it out and then I can imagine they start closing down some of these refrigeration units to save on to save on wow it's loud um, to save on their electric costs electric prices And then for 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 a big store like this, right? The store is probably I don't know, tw ten thousand square feet, twenty thousand square feet. For a store like this, it's gonna take their contractors quite some time in order to just uh, 
clear out everything. They're gonna have to uninstall all these. Um, flooring probably stays. You know, that's kind of the depends on the agreement with the with the with the next next people next folks leasing. Uh, all you know, all that stays. Uh, I I think all these shelves are removed and taken away, and no one needs them anymore. Yeah. All right. Let me go find that Starbucks. All right. Got my small coffee. I'm here in the grocery and deli area. Uh, looks like they've stopped making a lot of the stuff out here. Well, a lot of the stuff are are empty. They're not frying. I don't. I don't think they're doing the salads. Oh no, I, I see some salads still. Um, they have a fresh fresh uh, sushi section. I just talked to uh, the nice lady in the front. Uh, let's see if there's any soups. Just curious. No, no soups. Um, I was talking to a nice lady, uh, nice nice gal who was helping me with the coffee, um, and I asked uh, if 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 they have a location for her, because <coughs> obviously, um, the what. What Albertsons management has told the current employees in these Albertsons stores is, they will, uh, their jobs will not be affected, because they are working on a plan to send the current staff to other Albertson locations. So, um, you know, my logical question to 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 her was, uh, you know, or do you think they're gonna be relocated to? one of the two or three other Albertsons that are still to be in operations. So my count is there are five, right? Um, I believe there's five Albertsons stores right now and they're closing two. So this is one of the two. So that means there's only three, three, three stores left. So, you know, hopefully they can work out something that is, uh, beneficial for everyone. I'm just kind of scanning the aisles in case there's uh, some interesting deals. Right now, the only deals that I saw <laughs> is uh, um, is the uh, the little baby shirts. <laughs> but I'm going to walk down a couple of these empty aisles. And I'll be right back. Yeah, I know, I know my nose is out, but there really isn't anyone in here. It's still too early for Irvine. <laughs> 